going on? It's your boy T-Bone back here with another sneaker vid, or rather unboxing. So, this probably makes number 55 on the list. I don't mean to brag, but, you know, I'm a sneakerhead. This is what I do. I love sneakers. It's my passion. <clears throat> and I love to collect. Excuse me. Um. So, without further ado, before we get into it, let me just tell you, this sneaker was a hassle to get. Um. As you know or you don't know, I'm going on a cruise in a little bit. And, um, you know, I, I got to keep the feet looking fly. You know what I'm saying? Like, they got to be something on my feet that's just fly. You know what I'm saying? Something nice to me. Um, I couldn't do white uptowns because they actually crease and um, they turn yellow over time. Or rather, not even over time. I'm just going to say really quickly. That is over time. But I'm just going to say really, really quickly. I give it like maybe three to four days to a week tops. Especially if you wear them almost every day, which is something I don't do, but it's a dub for them white uptowns. It's probably the worst Nike sneaker in all history. But um, without further ado, let's get into my actual first female sneaker. I've never purchased a female sneaker in my life. And when I seen these online, I was just like, yo, I got to have them. And when I mean I got to have them, like I even paid for express shipping. So you know I paid a little, I paid a penny for these things actually. So I'm hype. They here now, and um, y'all could probably you probably wondering like why am I doing this video in the dark? But I gotta show y'all why. So without further ado, let's get into it. All right. So these are, like I said, these are women's uh, Nike 97s. If you're wondering what this is right here, this reflectiveness right here, this is called 3M. Teaching y'all something new for y'all newcomer sneaker heads out there. This is the 3M that wraps all the way around the sneaker. This is called the Summit White. And this is like really, really pretty. Like I, I wore these at least um, you know, like one time to try on. I had to make sure I was a woman's eleven. I actually got a pair of Ugg boots that's um a woman's eleven. Don't don't tell nobody I don't wear female Ugg boots, but you know, these happen to be tough. They the booty joints, so it's passable. I could get away with them, but these are the Summit Whites. You got your reflective 3M going all the way around. So that's why I'm shooting this video in the dark to give y'all a quick glimpse and, you know, pre presentation. I like the black bottom. That's, that, was a, that was a must because most of these um, 97 Whites, they all have white bottoms. And I'm not a fan of white bottoms or clear. So that's why I got the black bottom. And I was like beasting like I really wanted these. So this is your, like I said, reflective 3M with your mesh on the inside. You got your white laces. This is pretty much uh this is leather on the bottom right here. If anything. So it's a cool little sneaker. Like I said, I couldn't do any Air Maxes. I mean not Air Maxes, uptowns. I couldn't do those because they crease and they turn yellow over time. These I'm gonna actually keep these like in prestige condition. Like the way you see them now, I'm pretty sure you're gonna see these like the next five years looking the same way. So this is what I'm doing right here with the Summit Whites. This is actually um, the description, if anything, on the iPad. So it's the Nike Air Max 97 Surface and a fresh Summit White. Um, key features, all white leather and mesh upper with the 3M reflective piping on the upper, contrasting detailing in the black Air Max unit and outsole. So these is what I'm gonna be wearing on a cruise to the Bahamas. I got a few other things I could add to feet as well, but um, I'm hype I got these. I think these are about number 55 to the collection right here. You already know. Holla at me if you have any questions about some sneakers. Like, I really want to talk to somebody about kicks. Like, you know what I mean? I want to see I want to see what they have in their closet, what they have on feet, rather. You know what I'm saying? What's, what's their favorite sneak of all time? You know what I'm saying? Let's let's get into a conversation of what are we what, what are we doing with the feet, man? What are we doing with the bottoms right now, all right? Holla at me. Much love. It's your boy T-Bone 1, man. Yeah, Billy. Mm -hmm. All right, YouTube. So I'm back now with the on foot of the woman's white 97 cement this is how they look on the foot i have a woman's 11 normally i wear nine nine and a half in men but this is a woman's 11 very comfortable on foot shoe took no breaking in at all this is the shoe i wore during my travel to the bahamas on a cruise i received a lot of compliments from 
men and women. These sneakers happen to go with any color I happen to put on for an outfit, whether it be black shorts, white shorts, green shorts, red shorts, yellow shorts. Could have been a rainbow if you ask me, but they worked out perfectly fine <clears throat> with many outfits. Um, right now I have one shoe tied. The other shoe not tied is what I prefer. And these would be the women's 97 white cement. This is normally how I would wear it. Right now I have on a pair of joggers just to do this video, but I would probably wear these with uh, like joggers, shorts, jeans if you like, khakis and anything. Very comfortable shoe. Like I said, it goes with pretty much every outfit I own or any colorway you would like to wear. Also has 3M within the uh, mesh area. Very dope feature if you ask me. And I love the black bottom. So this was the review, the on foot review of the woman's 97 white cement. Thanks for watching. Much love. One. Yeah, Bill.